Welcome to Fantasy Audiobook. Machine Girl, from Contract Schoolgirl to the Strongest Commander. Chapter 1. In the Parallel World, on a Desolate Street. As far as the eye could see, there were broken walls and rubble everywhere. Even Lin Feng, who had a strong mentality, was a little confused. He had been playing his favorite world of fighter planes during the holidays, but he had unexpectedly come here. He shook his head, which was still a little dizzy, and prepared to organize his thoughts. Perfect fighter training system binding successful. You can fully activate the system by contracting a B-class combat concubine. The system is in a semi-activated state, only having the function of forcing the machine lady to log in. Other functions will be unlocked after activation. System. Did I transmigrate? Although Lin Feng was a little confused, he had already accepted the fact that he had transmigrated. However, he was different from other transmigrators because he had transmigrated physically. He knew nothing about this world. He had no identity and no memories in this world. He looked around. Based on his rich battlefield experience, he knew that there were frequent battles here and that it was not safe. He needed to leave as soon as possible and contract the machine lady. The moment Lin Feng turned around, he saw a magic beast with a red glow and a thick steel armor on its body. Its body was like a wolf, and its body was the size of an adult lion. Its sharp eyes were filled with greed and mockery, as if it had seen prey that was within its reach. The Wu. Lin Feng sighed to himself. Is this the so-called high-end game? He began to look around for usable weapons. He did not dare to move too much. He thought that the hungry wolf in front of him might pounce on him because of any movement. He found the only usable weapon in his peripheral vision, a brick. His eyes were still fixed on the evil wolf that he could not name. He approached it cautiously, then slowly squatted down, picked up the intact brick, and prepared to fight to the death. Vroom! The low roar of a sports car entered Lin Feng's ears. Then, a sports car whizzed over like a bolt of blue lightning. Magnetic! With the sound of brakes, a smooth and elegant blue sports car stopped steadily between Lin Feng and the mechanical wolf. There were no unnecessary movements. Before Lin Feng could react, a series of, kacha, kacha, sounds were heard. The sports car quickly turned around and transformed into a two-meter tall machine lady. In his surprise, Lin Feng saw the half-hidden pretty face under the mecha. This is the machine lady. Lin Feng's attention was instantly attracted. She was about 1.9 meters tall and wore a blue and black mecha. Under the mecha was a curvaceous body that was whiter than snow. Holding a one meter long sci-fi sword in each hand, he looked very heroic. A servant grade mechanical flame wolf. I can use you to practice my saber skills. The woman's voice was a little cold, like ice floating on spring water. The mechanical flame wolf, which was nearly two meters long, seemed to have sensed danger. Awu. It let out a loud howl, as if it was demonstrating its power and calling for its companions. After a wolf howl, the flame wolf took the initiative to launch an attack. It leapt forward and pounced towards the woman. Out of the way. Due to Lin Feng's long experience on the battlefield, he subconsciously pushed the woman away. The woman was stunned by Lin Feng's actions. What was he doing? But he was really strong. Lin Feng's subconscious action caused the woman's eyes to shine with a strange light. Ground State Shield Following the clear and beautiful voice, an extremely high-tech shield protected the woman and Lin Feng. The Flame Wolf's sharp front claws were blocked. Sky Raising Slash The woman quickly moved away, and when she attacked, she gave Flame Wolf a chilling blow. The seemingly sturdy mechanical Flame Wolf had become so fragile, causing the Flame Wolf to doubt its life. After an incomplete wail, the flame wolf's head fell to the ground. Dark red blood dripped down from the sword onto the ground. The woman's hands were trembling. She sighed in her heart, without a contracted commander, it is indeed a little difficult to fight directly. The woman withdrew her gorgeous mecha to reduce energy consumption. An extremely beautiful woman with a good figure appeared in front of Lin Feng. Her pair of peach blossom eyes were bright and clear. She slightly raised her head and pulled back her long silver hair, which flowed down her shoulders and casually fell on her towering peaks. She wore a sky blue tight dress and black laced combat boots. She was cool and elegant. Lin Feng was dazed for a moment. It was not only because of the woman's extremely beautiful appearance. 
It was also because of the smooth switching between the three forms that made Lin Feng a little surprised. Beautiful women, luxurious cars, and mechas were all men's romance. But when these three forms were combined into one, Lin Feng felt that it was somewhat inconceivable. This world was too wonderful for words. Lin Feng thought of the system's forced login function and prepared to give it a try. The forced login function had two functions. The first was to forcefully enter the machine lady's system to check the other party's various statuses and some secret information without the machine lady knowing. The second was to forcefully log into an uncontracted machine lady and connect to the other party's nervous system to obtain control of the machine lady or carrier. Lin Feng looked at the woman's basic information. Name, Su Qingyan. Form, Human, Sports Car, Machine Lady, Mecha, Requires Contracted Commander. Overall Rating, S. Applicable Energy, Nuclear, Solar, Fuel Energy. Kinetic Core, Blade, Integrated System, Pioneer Generation. Mecha Material, Ceramic Composite Metal Body. Contractual Relationship, Uncontracted. Open Black Lens Bracket, Close black lens bracket. Lin Feng was a little moved. Whether it was love at first sight or lust, it was fine. At this moment, the woman had already walked in front of him. Classmate, are you okay? My name is Su Qingyan. I'm a student from the nearby Pearl University. Quote. Her voice was still cold, but her eyes were burning. This completely opposite feeling was miraculously concentrated on this beautiful and mysterious woman. Lin Feng threw away the brick in his hand and brushed the dust off. I'm fine. I hope I didn't affect your battle just now. Su Qingyan looked at the brick that was thrown aside and thought about Lin Feng's subconscious action to protect her. He seemed to be different from the men she had met before. It's fine. You're very brave. But why did you come to this buffer zone alone? Quote. Buffer zone. Lin Feng was a little confused. He had never heard of this term before. Are you unfamiliar with it? Su Qingyan looked at Lin Feng curiously. His angular and unperturbed face was three parts sunshine and seven parts cold. His deep and clear eyes were filled with three parts arrogance and seven parts unswerving determination. If I say that I'm a transmigrator, will you think that I'm crazy? Lin Feng thought about it. Since he could not explain it, he might as well tell the truth. He knew very little about this world. If he said it directly, it would be justifiable for him to ask her about the situation. Su Qingyan was a little surprised. Like a curious baby, she walked around Lin Feng and looked at him carefully. After the particle collision experiment a hundred years ago, it caused space-time to be torn apart and multiple dimensions collided. This is indeed possible. The Higgs particle. Yes, we also call it the God particle. Without the God particle, all particles would be able to travel at the speed of light. Looks like you've succeeded. Lin Feng looked at the ruins around him and roughly knew how the steel monsters came to be. We succeeded. But that suicidal experiment was called the demonic beast calamity because it brought many steel monsters. In recent years, the war has been fierce. Many mechs and commanders have been sacrificed. The human territory has been shrinking rapidly. Su Qingyan said as she operated the steel flame wolf that she had just killed. She took out an object that was filled with technology and energy. This is an energy crystal. It can be used to upgrade armor. Of course, it can also be used to exchange for money. After a simple exchange, Lin Feng had a basic understanding of this world. This was a world of machine girls. Once a woman reached adulthood, she could be equipped with a technological core and become a machine girl. After becoming a machine girl, she could freely switch between her human form, carrier form, and machine form. When a man reached adulthood, he had the chance to awaken as a commander and could contract a war girl. After completing the contract, the war girl would unlock her mech form. The commander could enter the mech's cockpit and connect to the nervous system and sensory system to fight alongside the mech. Not good. Run. Just as she finished speaking, Su Qingyan heard the alarm. This is the buffer zone. It's not safe. A few demonic beasts are approaching. I haven't contracted a commander yet. I can't fight for a long time. Su Qingyan put away the crystal and pulled Lin Feng toward the headquarter city. Su Qingyan had no choice but to transform into the blue-bladed sports car when she saw the wolves getting closer. Get in, get in. Lin Feng glanced at the wolves in the distance. 
He knew the situation was urgent, so he got into the driver's seat without hesitation. Su Qingyan wanted Lin Feng to change his seat. After all, it was the commander's seat, and no one had ever sat there before. However, she gave up when she saw the wolves getting closer. Her first impression of Lin Feng was quite good. He was calm in the face of trouble, and his eyes were clear. Most importantly, she was looking forward to seeing Lin Feng protect her instinctively. Not only did it require courage, but it also required a sense of responsibility. She even hoped that Lin Feng was a commander. Lin Feng had a strange feeling when he got into the car. The smooth and delicate texture and the smooth lines made him restless. The car had already sped out, and the wolves were following closely behind. Detected forcefully logged in carrier. Do you want to log in? Lin Feng wanted to try it out. After all, it was not something a sports car could compare to. However, that would be rude. If he had to choose between fast food and home-cooked food, he preferred home-cooked food. After all, he could eat at any time. He looked at the dashboard of the bladed sports car. The controls should be similar. He asked tentatively, can I have a test drive? Su Qingyan was stunned, and the car shook slightly. But, without a contract, you can't connect to the nervous system, and you can't control it. I think I'm quite talented in driving. I want to experience it. Then you can step on it. You can put your hands on it, but even if I'm willing, you can only feel it. You can't drive without permission. Since they had not signed a contract, Su Qingyan had a strange feeling when she said that. If she was in human form, she would have blushed. Lin Feng summoned the system when Su Qingyan agreed. Forced log in. Forced log in successful. Nervous system binding successful. You have obtained control. Lin Feng was a little excited. After getting used to it, he began to perform. However, it was a new car, and Lin Feng did not drive violently. Nevertheless, his driving skills were on full display. He quickly shook off the wolves, left the buffer zone, and entered Junhai headquarter city. After the magical beast calamity, human territories were gradually invaded by the magical beasts. Humans began to build base cities to protect their last living environment. The area between the forbidden area and the base city became a buffer zone. Many adventurers would come to hunt the magic beasts that escaped from the forbidden area. Lin Feng loved the car so much that he couldn't bear to part with it. However, Su Qingyan had used up too much energy and couldn't bear the burden anymore. Switching back to his human form, Zhang Zan's forehead was covered in sweat, and his brows were slightly furrowed. Why did you lie to me? You are clearly the commander. Su Qingyan's reproachful tone carried a hint of anticipation. I'm not lying to you, and I didn't participate in the awakening ceremony you mentioned. Then how did you get the control rights just now? A, hey, that's not right. Even if you're the commander, you shouldn't be able to get the control rights without a contract. Lin Feng was inexplicably excited when he heard this. Did this mean that he would be able to experience all the mechas in the future? I don't know either. Maybe this is talent. He could talk about his transmigration, but it was best not to let anyone know about the system. Besides, this is his first time being driven. Can't you be a little gentler? I've already purposely controlled it. I didn't exceed the speed limit or travel long distances. Su Qingyan looked at Lin Feng as if she understood. All right. I didn't expect you to be so talented in driving. Quote. I used to be a special forces pilot in the Air Force. Fighter jets are nothing to me. Lin Feng was quite knowledgeable when it came to driving. After all, he was the youngest all-rounded special forces pilot and was extremely talented. Then you and my dad should have something in common. My dad is an ace pilot, and my mom is a fighter jet. Lin Feng was a little surprised. You have a fighter jet? Yes. My sister has successfully loaded a destroyer, but it doesn't seem to be of any use now. Instead, it's giving her a lot of trouble. That's a ship girl. Isn't that pretty strong? Quote. You can also call her a ship girl. Although Junhai City is close to the sea, as the living space continues to shrink, it has lost control of the sea. Furthermore, she can only use nuclear energy. This kind of commander is extremely difficult to find. Su Qingyan paused for a moment before continuing. Later on, a powerful ship girl came out of nowhere and took control of the coastal waters. Her nickname is Snow Wind, and we don't know if she's a friend or foe. 
Lin Feng's heart was filled with longing. This world seemed pretty good. Perhaps it would be a magnificent adventure. Snow Wind. I can't afford to offend her now. I'll think about it in the future. Although he was looking forward to it, the most important thing now was how to become a commander and successfully contract a ship girl. After the first drive experience, Lin Feng was sure that this was the best car he had ever driven. He definitely couldn't let it go. Moreover, Su Qingyan's beauty was so devastatingly beautiful that any man would want to possess her. Lin Feng asked directly, can I be your only pilot? Su Qingyan's heart trembled slightly, and her face turned slightly red. As the campus belle of the university, it was inevitable that she would have many suitors, but she had never been as moved as she was now. I actually quite like your personality. Unfortunately, you're not a commander. Su Qingyan was looking forward to it, but there was nothing she could do. After all, the best choice for a ship girl was to be a commander. Just based on the fact that Lin Feng dared to hit Flame Wolf with a brick and subconsciously saved her, she was already moved. It had been almost a year since she had loaded the ship girl system. She had tried to find a suitable commander before. However, it was either a bootlicker or a rich young master who was afraid of death. She didn't want to become a deserter on the battlefield. Moreover, she knew that most of these people were just lusting after her body. If she met someone with a slightly better personality, but the commander talent level was too low, she wouldn't be satisfied. Su Qingyan's answer didn't make Lin Feng feel disappointed. Instead, he was excited. After all, the system definitely wouldn't give him a mission that he couldn't complete. I'm 23 years old now. I should have a chance to awaken as a commander, right? Hearing this, Su Qingyan's somewhat disappointed eyes instantly lit up, that's right. If you haven't awakened before, you can. After all, 18 years old is the minimum requirement. Quote. After receiving Su Qingyan's confirmation, Lin Feng's previous worries were swept away. If I don't have a student status here, can I awaken? This was Lin Feng's last concern. Others might not be able to, but I should be able to do it. Although Su Qingyan had never done such a thing before, her parents had made great contributions to the military and had a high position in the military. The university would still accept this. Moreover, every outstanding commander would be a great help to this precarious headquarter city. Hearing this, Lin Feng was secretly happy. It seemed that this transmigration was quite successful. More importantly, this world seemed to be very hot-blooded. Commanders also had a high position. Not only did they have wealth and power at their fingertips, but they also had many beautiful female fighters to choose from. Wait a moment, I'll call my father. Do you want me to use Lin Feng's name? Lin Feng nodded. Su Qingyan took out her phone and tapped it on her hand as she walked. She seemed to be organizing her words. She was a proud and aloof girl. She didn't like to ask for help from her family, nor did she like the perfect path her family had arranged for her. But now, she compromised. However, it was also because of this that Su Yunpeng, who had always been a principled person, agreed after being surprised. He told her that her identity could be solved immediately, and she could go to Pearl University to awaken at any time. Su Qingyan patted her chest and let out a long breath. A smile that hadn't been seen in a long time appeared on her face. She waved her phone and said to Lin Feng, it's done. Let's go to the university directly. Quote, the thing that worried him the most was solved, and Lin Feng's heart was finally at ease. However, he told himself that he couldn't be complacent yet. After all, in his impression, transmigrators would awaken as trash talents and be mocked by everyone. Then, they would turn the tables. He only hoped that he could reach the passing mark. After all, he still had the system in his hands. Pearl University and Black Dome University were the top universities in Junhai headquarter city. The two universities faced each other across the river. They were known as the twin stars of Junhai headquarter city. Although one would have the ability and wisdom to withstand the transformation of a machine after reaching adulthood, one had to complete the awakening and the installation of the system in a university. This was because it was an extremely complicated and mystical technology. Therefore, the awakening technology was the pinnacle of science in this world. After a roar filled with power, everyone at the entrance of Pearl University looked over. They held their breaths and moved aside naturally. A woman who could make everyone hold their breaths was definitely a peerless beauty. 
And the woman who came in at this moment. Not only was she the only S grade machine girl in Pearl University, other than the teachers. She also had an indescribably beautiful face and a perfect body that made many girls feel ashamed of their inferiority. Su Qingyan didn't care about the gazes around her. She was still as graceful and calm as before. However, there was another person beside her now. She couldn't help but look at the tall and handsome Lin Feng. After the two left, the people around them slowly spoke. The cold beauty is back. She must have gone to the buffer zone to hunt magical beasts. It's a pity that no commander has been able to gain her favor for a year. I heard that she rejected all the military's attempts to contact her. That's right, an s rank machine lady. If there was a suitable commander, she would have become famous long ago. That's not right. Who is the person beside Su Qingyan? There doesn't seem to be such a person among the young masters in the school. But that man doesn't seem out of place when he's with the school bell. Could it be? I don't care anymore. Let's follow them and take a look. Quote dot 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 quote. On the other side, the suitors who received the news also rushed down. Su Qingyan, this is AC grade modification material that my dad spent 100 million to buy. Do you want to take a look? Su Qingyan, look at mine. This is a jet defense system that can't be bought with money. Quote dot 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 quote. What's your level? How dare you imitate me and chase after women? A burly third year student walked over. These suitors were all from rich and powerful families, but they all retreated when they heard Chu Zi's voice. This was because Chu Zi had awakened an A-ranked commander talent and his family was a giant. Young Master Chu, you're here. Young Master Chu, we were just fooling around. As long as you know what you're doing. Chu Zi said as he caught up with Su Qingyan. Qingyan, after the orientation is the Twin City Hegemony competition. Why don't you consider me? Su Qingyan said resolutely. I said that I won't hand over control to someone without faith. Xinyan, I have faith. You're my faith. You're so beautiful. Why do you have to do something so dangerous? Su Qingyan looked at Lin Feng's calm face and made a decision in her heart. As long as Lin Feng succeeded in awakening, even if it was the lowest level commander talent, she was willing to complete the contract with him. Chu Zi saw that Su Qingyan was ignoring him and quickly went up to her with a greedy smile. Qingyan, why are you ignoring me? Do you know that my hot face needs your cold ass? Su Qingyan instantly exploded. Shameless. Get lost. Quote. Then, she kicked Chu Zi out. Chu Zi was in pain but still stood up with difficulty and ran up again. It's my honor to be kicked by the most beautiful leg in the world. Why don't you kick me again? Lin Feng couldn't help but raise his eyebrows. Lin Feng thought that Chu Zi would explode, but he didn't expect him to continue licking. He didn't even give him a chance to attack. Su Qingyan immediately summoned the mechanical auxiliary arm of the turbocharger. Isn't it good to live well? Then, a person flew out like a meteor. Ah, it feels so good to be in the clouds. Then, he landed accurately on the nano anti-impact mat used for training on the field. The other pursuers were used to this. They even felt that Su Qingyan was willing to speak today and felt that there was a chance. He's also a bootlicker. If he can do it, why can't we? Yes, continue. Su Qingyan turned around, and a cold light emitted from her eyes. The people who were about to move forward were instantly silenced and didn't dare to take another step forward. However, Su Qingyan's pursuers were not limited to these. There were also admirers in society and other schools. Today, because Lin Feng was present, Su Qingyan deliberately controlled herself. Otherwise, these pursuers would have already lost their ability to move. Lin Feng didn't know where his courage came from, but he naturally held Su Qingyan's hand. Okay, don't be angry over these small things. Su Qingyan's hand trembled slightly as if it had been electrocuted, but she didn't have any intention of breaking free. The pursuers behind sighed. They really hoped that their eyes could kill. The people who had been following them from the school gate to watch the show became even more excited. They vaguely felt that the person who could calmly stand beside the school bell was not an ordinary person. Now that they saw him holding hands, their eyes were filled with shock and envy. Without the harassment of the crowd, the two quickly arrived at the entrance of the awakening hall. There were actually many leaders waiting at the door. Lin Feng couldn't help but be surprised. Su Qingyan's family's strength and background were extraordinary. It gave him a little pressure. 
If his awakening level was low, wouldn't he be a freeloader? Su Qingyan saw that it was so grand and felt a little apologetic. Principal Lu, sorry for the trouble. I'll let you open it alone. It's okay. In three days, the new students will begin to awaken. Lu Gang, who looked around 50 years old, was a 5-star S-rank commander. He was ranked 5th on the Junhai commander list. In this world, the ranks of the commander and mecha were fixed from 1 to 9 stars. Lu Gang looked at Lin Feng, who had a strong aura, and then turned to ask, is this little friend going to awaken? Su Qingyan brought up an information panel and said, yes, this is Lin Feng's identity information. He missed the opportunity to awaken because he was out on a secret mission. He's back to continue his training. The identity that Su Yunpeng gave to Lin Feng was a spy who had been on top secret missions for a long time. If he was investigated later, it would be normal for him to lose his previous information. This world had been at war for a long time, and many people were sacrificed every day. Therefore, no one doubted his identity. Director Wei, you will personally bring Lin Feng to awaken. A middle-aged man with black-rimmed glasses next to him stretched out his hand and said, It's ready, please. He looked very humble, but Lin Feng could tell that this man was very shrewd. There was even a trace of hostility in his eyes. Moreover, the way he looked at Su Qingyan just now made him feel very uncomfortable. However, he still said calmly, Uncle Lu, you don't have to give me special treatment. Since I've returned from a mission, I'm just a normal person. You can treat me like a new student. When Lu Gang heard Lin Feng call him uncle, he was very pleased. After all, the chief had personally instructed him to do this. This young man was definitely not simple. He admired Lin Feng's actions, but he thought that he was just being polite. It's okay, Director Wei is also free now. Su Qingyan, who was at the side, understood Lin Feng a little. She didn't have a good impression of Wei Xian because he had repeatedly hinted to Su Qingyan to form a contract with him. Su Qingyan went forward and said, Principal Lu, just follow Lin Feng's wishes. If you make such a high standard, it will only make him nervous and affect his awakening. Why don't you let Sister Jian Wei help him? Lu Gang nodded. That's true, I didn't think it through. Xiao Wei, go help Mr. Lin awaken. Jian Wei used her hand to press down on her collar quietly. After confirming that there was nothing wrong, she walked forward enthusiastically. Her delicate face was charming but not seductive. She wore a pair of half-frame titanium alloy glasses on her high nose bridge. Her every frown and smile was very charming. Her graceful figure was matched with a tight-fitting office lady uniform. Her soft black hair was casually draped over her shoulders, but it didn't look messy at all. She was definitely the ceiling of the pure desire world. She was the counselor of Su Qingyan's department. She knew Jian Wei's operating standards and character very well. Therefore, she directly gave the best advice. Then I'll have to trouble you, teacher. Lin Feng nodded slightly to express his satisfaction. Jian Wei smiled slightly and gestured with her hand. You're welcome. This way please. Jian Wei's voice was very magnetic, and her actions were very dignified and elegant. Lin Feng followed Jian Wei into the awakening room. He could feel the advanced technology. Jian Wei activated the equipment according to the steps. Although she had not been in charge of awakening for a long time, she was very skilled. However, his standard was very high. He was meticulous and meticulous in his work. The equipment in the awakening room was very complicated. Occasionally, he could see electric currents and various transparent devices operating with energy and molecules. He had only seen these in science fiction movies. The crowd outside was also looking forward to it. Su Qingyan was especially nervous. She was even more excited than when she was awakened. Her breathing became rapid, and the two big headlights flickered. The equipment is ready. Relax, I hope you can achieve good results. Jian Wei smiled and gestured for Lin Feng to enter the awakening room. After entering the awakening room, Jian Wei followed the steps and placed his hand on the energy ball. Jian Wei activated the awakening ceremony. A light blue light enveloped Lin Feng. The light was blinding. Then, the sky changed color. The wind blew, and the bright divine light shone on the entire Junhai base city. The vast and terrifying aura was raging. It was like a greedy beast devouring everything around it. 
The students outside found it difficult to breathe under the pressure of this force, and their bodies were on the verge of collapsing. What's going on? Is this a Genesis awakening specifically for him alone? Quote. Can you use your brain? It's so obvious. Is this an A-rank commander talent? Quote. Can you use your brain too? This is just an A-rank. I don't believe a word of it. Quote. Looks like our Pearl University is going to be famous again. Quote dot 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 quote. The teachers outside the awakening room were also very excited, except for Wei Xian. He was a little angry now. He always thought that as long as there was no outstanding commander, Su Qingyan would be his sooner or later. How is this possible? How can he awaken an S rank commander talent? Quote. Liu Gang was originally excited. However, after hearing Wei Xian's words, he looked at Wei Xian seriously. It's impossible. An S rank wouldn't cause such a big commotion. No one knew better than him what an S rank's commotion was. Liu Gang's words were like a bolt from the blue. He was only an A rank. If it was really an S rank, then it was impossible for him to awaken. Could it be the legendary SS level? A very authoritative professor murmured as he saw the vast aura continue to expand. In an instant, all the teachers and students who reacted were completely dumbfounded. Their eyes were filled with disbelief. Su Qingyan's beautiful eyes trembled. She was already looking forward to the hot-blooded scene of her and Lin Feng fighting together after forming a contract. While he was shocked, it also brought him some pressure. If it really was SS grade, she might not be able to bear it. Ten minutes later, the violent aura dissipated and the dark clouds dispersed. Darkness once again returned the clear sky to Junhai City. Jian Wei, who had witnessed the entire process, had the greatest emotional fluctuation and was also the most shocked. From lightly biting her red lips and holding her breath in anticipation to being so shocked that she couldn't close her mouth in ecstasy. Previously, she was still regretting that she had not seen an S class. She did not expect to personally awaken an SSS class. Seeing that Lin Feng had already opened the door of the awakening chamber, Jian Wei's eyes were half closed. She smiled like a flower and said enthusiastically and professionally, Congratulations, Lin Feng. You have awakened an SSS level commander talent, which is also the strongest talent. At this moment, Lin Feng was also secretly pleased. He had originally wanted to get a minimum wage, but now, he felt like he had won the lottery. Thank you, teacher. Happy working with you. He replied in a neither servile nor overbearing manner and then looked at the electronic display. Jian Wei replied enthusiastically, happy working with you. I really hope that we will have a chance to work together in the future. She had always been calm and steady. She did not dare to be too obvious. In this world, an SSS level commander talent was irresistible to all machine girls. As a phantom motorcycle, she naturally could not resist. She did not know Lin Feng's specific identity. She was afraid that she would be presumptuous. However, she did not want to miss the opportunity to enter the water and have the moon first. Lin Feng did not pay too much attention to Jian Wei's somewhat conflicted thoughts. Instead, he directly looked at his own information. Name, Lin Feng. Position, One Star Commander. Energy Core, Awaken, can provide all types of energy. It can allow energy to be transmitted over a long distance without any damage. Energy conversion ability increased by 300%. Energy pool capacity increased by 300%. Strength. 26, Stamina, 23, Mental Power, 18, Agility, 16, Defense, 21. Open Black Lens Bracket, Close Black Lens Bracket. It looked very good, but Lin Feng did not understand the overall situation of the other commanders. He also could not see the specific advantages. He turned to Jian Wei, who was staring at him in a daze. Sister Wei, can you introduce me? Jian Wei hurriedly collected her thoughts and opened her red lips slowly. The energy core is the standard to measure the commander talent. If the energy core is not activated, it means that the awakening has failed and you cannot become a commander. In addition, the energy core has three important indicators. The first is the type of energy. The more types of energy it can provide, the wider the types of mechs that can be contracted. Generally, commanders below grade A can only have one type of energy. After hearing this, Lin Feng's eyes lit up. Indeed, there was no harm without comparison. 
In other words, I can contract all types of mechs. Jian Wei nodded and continued, the other two important indicators are the energy conversion ability. This represents the upper limit of the amount of energy a commander can draw from the surroundings in a unit time. The storage capacity represents the upper limit of the energy that the energy core can store. Do you know what's your most heaven-defying advantage? Jian Wei smiled and asked with a fiery gaze. What is it? Normally, a commander can only contract one battle concubine. This is because the commander's energy core and the battle concubine's kinetic energy core need to be smashed into the pilot cabin for one-to-one -one close range threading. Even so, there will be a lot of energy loss. However, you are different. You support long distance lossless transmission. This means that you can contract multiple battle concubines. After hearing this, Lin Feng was shocked. So, a normal commander and battle concubine cannot be changed once the contract is completed. It's not that they can't. However, cancelling the contract will result in a lot of losses for both parties. Therefore, they are usually very cautious. This is also the reason why I haven't signed a contract yet. So, you haven't signed a contract yet. Lin Feng was surprised. He checked Jian Wei's information. Yes, if you have any ideas, please consider me. I, I am very willing to become your battle concubine. After saying this, Jian Wei's snow white skin turned red at a speed visible to the naked eye. This was the most straightforward sentence she could think of. After seeing Jian Wei's information, Lin Feng was a little tempted. However, he did not give an answer immediately. Firstly, he had an agreement with Su Qingyan. Secondly, his system had not been fully activated. He did not know the specific functions. Blindly signing a contract would be extremely irresponsible to himself and his battle concubine. Yes, I will. Jian Wei was a little disappointed by Lin Feng's cautious attitude. However, she admired him even more. As the youngest and most beautiful teacher in Pearl University, she also had many suitors. If it were any other person, if they knew that they could contract multiple machine girls and that they had encountered a young, beautiful, and powerful phantom motorcycle, they would have been elated and would have gladly accepted it. Junhai City, Black Firmament Academy. Black Firmament mainly focused on the training of the military and the maintenance of the city. A group of leaders were discussing the next iteration of a special energy storage core, preparing to update it to the second generation. The sudden appearance of the strange phenomenon also alarmed the school leaders. As the principal, Xiao Shun knew that a commander with an S rank talent or above had appeared. That was because the female form of the loader would not appear. Xiao Shun was a little envious and confused. Aren't we not allowed to apply for admission now? The dean beside him quickly said, I just called and asked. They said that the commander from the military came back at the last minute. It seems like he went with Su Qingyan. Although Pearl Institute and Black Firmament were the top forces in Junhai City, there had always been competition between them. Liu Gang was already stronger than them. Now that an extremely strong commander had appeared, it seemed like the balance was going to tilt again. Any random person is an S rank or above. How are we supposed to live? You said that Su Qingyan brought him there. Yeah, Sai, if only Su Qingwan met him. It's a pity that the military didn't come to our school but we should still find out more about the energy core. If it's a nuclear energy core, we can sign a contract with Su Qingwan. Then it's not impossible to take back the sea control. Quote dot 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 quote. Su Qingwan, who was studying theory in the science museum, also saw the phenomenon. She looked at the source of the energy fluctuation and quickly called her sister. Seeing that the call was connected, Su Qingwan quickly asked, Sister, what kind of monster did your school have? What a huge commotion. Quote, yeah, it might be an SS ranked commander. Su Qingyan's excited and happy voice came from the other side. Double SS rank. Is that shocking? Do you know him, sister? Quote, I do. Why? Can you help me find out about the energy interface? Is there any nuclear energy? I can, but even if there's a nuclear energy interface, he can only be your brother in law. Su Qingyan blushed as she said that. Su Qingyan was not worried about the energy source. Fuel was the most common energy source. Moreover, she had two other special energy sources. Sister, good, you. Love will disappear if you don't share the good stuff with me, right? Su Qingyan started to speak in a coquettish tone. When I made the promise with him, 
I didn't expect him to awaken such a high talent, but this really can't happen, unless, we go back and talk about it. Lin Feng appeared. Seeing Lin Feng walk out of the awakening hall, Su Qingyan hung up the phone. Su Qingwan was left staring at her phone in a daze. Lin Feng's appearance also caused a commotion in the surroundings. Many of the female schemers could no longer remain calm. I'm an A-class tanker, requesting a contract. A-class off-road mountain vehicle. Violent driving is supported. Please give me a chance. B-class bus, excellent endurance, please take it away. Bus, don't join in the fun. Even the headlights are out of shape. Excavator requests to join the battle. Quote dot 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 quote. Seeing these goddesses, who were usually worshipped, fawning over Xu Tian, the commanders behind them were divided into two factions. The conservatives thought that the copywriting was lacking, the licking wasn't explicit enough, and it didn't fully display its advantages. The radicals believed that it was not enough to just shout. Kneeling and licking his boots would show more sincerity. Liu Gang was the first to welcome him. Little friend Lin, congratulations. You have a double SS talent, right? Quote, because they had never seen an SS talent before, they did not even dare to think about an SSS talent. Therefore, Liu Gang's opinion was the same as the professor's analysis. This made Lin Feng a little confused. After all, the other party was a five-star commander. Should he keep a low profile? Seeing this, the understanding Jian Wei stepped forward and said, Lin Feng has an SSS talent. He can be considered the only commander with an SSS talent in the country. SSS talent. Everyone's hearts that had just calmed down were pulled up again. Liu Gang was the first to recover from the shock. He quickly took Lin Feng's data from Jian Wei. Liu Gang's eyes lit up. Congratulations, little friend Lin Feng. Are you going back to the military? No, I'm going to find a place to train. After all, there are still a lot of things I don't know. If you don't mind, why don't you consider Pearl Institute? Our teachers and resources are among the best in the country. All right, I'll consider it. However, Lin Feng's attitude gave Liu Gang some hope. Since he didn't directly reject him, it meant that he might choose to study in a university. Liu Gang continued, I can apply for a large, luxurious villa near the school for you. You can choose which classes you want, and you can even choose the teachers you like to tutor you. Lin Feng was stunned. This treatment for a talented commander was too cool. It was hard to reject such treatment. Not only did he get a house, he even got a personal tutor. Lin Feng really needed to learn about this world's technology. Many of the technologies were very advanced, and he hadn't come into contact with them before. Most importantly, this was a world where one could face real battles at any time. Any knowledge or battle technique could save one's life at a crucial moment. Uncle Lu, since you're so enthusiastic, it wouldn't be right for me to reject. Just put me in the same class as Su Qingyan. The leaders were all overjoyed. After all, every time a university nurtured an outstanding commander, they would gain both fame and fortune. Jian Wei was also overjoyed. This way, she would have more opportunities to interact with Lin Feng in the future. It didn't seem so unattainable anymore. Liu Gang was overjoyed when he heard this. He immediately told the dean to do it, as if he was afraid that Lin Feng would change his mind. Of course, Wei Xian was an exception. His idea was very good. Once he successfully contracted Su Qingyan, not only would he have an extremely beautiful and talented combat concubine, but he would also be able to obtain a high-ranking combat concubine. Furthermore, he would be able to use the resources behind her to jump up and become a person above others. However, all of his efforts had gone down the drain. Even the a rank combat concubine that he had ruthlessly removed in order to increase his chances of getting Su Qingyan had become someone else's ride. He didn't even have the courage to look at Lin Feng. Not only was Lin Feng's talent oppressing him, but Su Qingyan's background was also powerful. She could easily destroy him with a flick of her finger. Liu Gang excitedly pulled Lin Feng aside and continued, Jian Wei is your tutor. Although she's only 25 years old, her theoretical foundation is top-notch. Her rank isn't high because she hasn't signed a contract yet, so she hasn't unlocked her mech form. It just so happens that you can apply to contract multiple warframes. If you have any ideas, I can help you with the complicated application process. I can also help you with it. This poison is excellent for both of you. 
All right, let's talk more when we have time. Ching Yun is still waiting for me to form the contract. Su Ching Yun's, Lin Feng, Lin, 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 and Lin Feng. Lin, Lin Feng. Lin Feng, Lin Feng, Lin Feng, Lin, 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 Shi. Lin. Lin Feng casually teased, What are you thinking in that head of yours? Dot 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 Su Qingyan blushed, but since they had decided to sign a contract, she would cooperate with Lin Feng if he wanted to do something. I just want to remind you. After all, signing a contract in this world is equivalent to marriage. It's protected by the contract rules. If we cancel the contract, both parties will be greatly affected. Su Qingyan said honestly. She didn't want Lin Feng to make a decision because he wasn't sure. Don't worry, I will never cancel the contract. Okay, then let's go register the contract now. Su Qingyan was in a good mood after receiving Lin Feng's affirmation. She grabbed Lin Feng's arm. At this moment, there were many heartbroken sounds and envious gazes outside. The goddess that was once worshipped by tens of thousands of people took the initiative to hold Xu Tian's arm. Her attitude was very obvious. Lin Feng looked at the breathtakingly beautiful woman in front of him. He was excited and didn't hesitate at all. Don't you need to confirm with your parents? Since the contract was equivalent to marriage, Lin Feng felt that it was better to ask. No need. My parents said that I will decide on my own about the contract. Also, if they knew that the contract partner was you, an SSS commander, they would probably laugh in their dreams. Since Su Qingyan was holding his arm, he naturally couldn't fall behind. He directly carried her in a princess carry and walked towards the registration counter. The cold Su Qingyan was also slightly blushing. She was like a little bird that was leaning on him. Lin Feng was a little excited with her soft body in his arms. He was also looking forward to it. Was this really considered a marriage? Amidst the exclamations and envy of the crowd, the two of them went straight to the contract registration hall. Every city had a special contract registration office. Once a contract was completed, it would be protected by the contract rules. There were many people at the registration office. After all, a contract wasn't as simple as registering a marriage. Just taking a picture, stamping, and getting a certificate was enough. A contract required all kinds of systems and interfaces to be connected. It was very high-tech and time-consuming. After the two of them printed the information and handed it over, they returned to the waiting area and started exchanging information. This is my talent information. Confirm it again. Su Qingyan knew that an SSS talent was powerful, but she didn't expect it to be this powerful. Many question marks appeared in her mind. All energy. Long-distance transmission. No damage. Three times the conversion ability, three times the capacity of the energy pool. Every single one of them felt a little unreal. After reading it, Su Qingyan asked excitedly, then you can apply to be a multi-combat concubine. Don't worry. If you think it's inappropriate, I won't apply. I will train you into a perfect combat concubine. Su Qingyan quickly shook her head. With great power comes great responsibility. A commander as excellent as you is the lucky star of Junhai City. So should I say that you're magnanimous or magnanimous? Contrary to Lin Feng's expectations, Su Qingyan didn't think it was inappropriate. Instead, she was pleasantly surprised. I'm not as magnanimous as you say. This is the commander's right. Not only will I not mind, all the combat concubines, including the military, will support it. There are too few commanders in this world, so many combat concubines don't have contracts. Quote. Su Qingyan hesitated and said seriously, What I want to ask you is, do you mind having another combat concubine? Hem. Lin Feng was confused. Could it be that he had encountered such a good thing? Didn't I mention my sister before? If you're willing, she'll be so happy that she won't be able to sleep. Quote. Although Su Qingyan felt that this kind of relationship was a little awkward, it might be good for the three of them. Your sister. Is she also at Pearl Academy? Quote. She's at the Black Heaven Academy across from us. The ratio of women there is higher. Most of them are from the military or city maintenance. Then let's meet when we have time. 
If you and your parents don't mind, of course I don't mind. He originally thought that with Su Qingyan's domineering personality, it would be impossible for him to have many wives and concubines. He didn't expect Su Qingyan to be so tolerant. When Su Qingyan heard this, a beautiful smile appeared on her face. She said very sincerely, Okay, thank you. Lin Feng was surprised. Shouldn't I be the one thanking you? Su Qingyan continued, But my sister's energy consumption is very high. The military can only look at the ship and sigh. Lin Feng was not flustered. On the contrary, he was looking forward to it. He was a military fan. Not only did he have an SSS grade talent, but he also had a mysterious system. After the commander rises in stars, the energy conversion ability and energy storage capacity of the energy core will also continue to increase, right? Yes, you have the highest innate talent, so every time you rise by one star, the base of the increase is very large. About two stars will be enough to provide her with the energy to transform into her armor. All right, then there's no pressure. Lin Feng, Su Qingyan, head to the contract cabin to contract. The voice message began to play. Lin Feng pulled Su Qingyan into the contract cabin and followed the instructions to make all sorts of preparations and adjustments. Resonance system connection successful. Neural system connection successful. Kinetic energy system matching successful. Interactive system matching successful. Open black lens bracket, close black lens bracket. After the complicated contract process, the two successfully completed the contract and the message was uploaded normally. Su Qingyan's face was a little excited. She suddenly turned around and said, Hubby. Lin Feng was stunned. Is this for real? Seeing Lin Feng in a daze, Su Qingyan smiled sweetly and teased, What, are you regretting it right after the contract? Aren't you supposed to call me your wife? There's no sense of ceremony at all. Quote. He received a lot of messages in one day. Lin Feng still felt like he was dreaming. He married such a beautiful wife so easily. No betrothal gifts, no house, and even a top grade war chariot. And a school bell with a mysterious family background. He didn't even dare to dream of doing this before, right? Looking at the beautiful face that was right in front of him, Lin Feng adjusted himself and finally said, Old, wifey. His voice was a little shaky, but it was very real. Even the toughest man had his weaknesses. Their eyes met, and the hormones around them soared. The distance between the two was getting closer and closer. It was as if there was some kind of magic pulling both parties to break through the distance between them. I don't care. Lin Feng made up his mind and hugged her. It was very smooth. It was a little rough, but it was hot. Their lips parted for a long time, and the warm touch made Lin Feng forget to leave. The lingering sound hit his soul. I don't care, follow my heart. Again, the two only stopped when more and more people gathered around them. Lin Feng was still a little emotional. Was this kind of thing something that could be watched? Lin Feng simply carried her and walked out, ignoring the shock and envy of the crowd. Do you have a problem with me carrying my wife? Just as he walked out of the registration area, a system notification popped up. Perfect warrior training system has been successfully activated. Reward. S-grade accessory, sky pivot wings. All system functions have been successfully activated. Function 1. The more the better, every time you contract a B-grade or above warrior, all attributes of the kinetic energy core can be increased. Double rewards for killing demonic beasts. Function 2. Stronger against strong. Fighting across ranks, all attributes of self and mecha are increased by 50%. Function 3. Perfect Warrior Training Store. The store provides high-tech accessories that are not yet available to humans. Points can be obtained by killing demonic beasts or contracting mecha. Lin Feng was a little excited. It was an S-grade accessory. Previously, he heard that a C-grade accessory was 100 million. How much would an S-grade accessory be? Moreover, this thoughtful function complemented his talent as a commander. After seeing the beautiful face of the woman in Lin Feng's arms, the people on the road all looked at them with envy and doubt. However, Lin Feng did not slow down because of this. He was eager to experience the feeling of piloting a mech. However, he was not sure how long the energy could last. More importantly, he had no experience in piloting it. Lin Feng opened the information panel. The reward from the contract with Su Qingyan had taken effect. 
Not only did he receive 2,000 points, but his attributes also increased. After the contract was completed, Lin Feng's five attributes increased by five points each. It was a very good increase. According to Su Qingyan's introduction, normal people's attributes were only between 10 and 15. Lin Feng's lowest attribute was 21. Strength, 31. Stamina, 28. Spiritual power, 23. Agility, 21. Defense, 26. A person's attributes directly affected how long they could continue to command and pilot. Although the firepower output on the battlefield depended on the warrior concubine. However, the other battlefield also had a higher requirement on their physique. Lin Feng looked at the specific value of his energy core. This was the key to maintaining the mech in battle. After contracting an S-class warrior concubine, his energy core attribute increased by 20%. Adding on the strong 300% increase from his talent, it was a total of 320% increase. Energy storage limit, 960 megajoules. Energy conversion per hour, 32 megajoules. Current energy, 300 megajoules. Energy storage ratio, 32%. He opened the energy consumption of the blade dancer. Carrier state, 10 megajoules per hour. Female machine state, 20 megajoules per hour. Mech state, 30 megajoules per hour. After comparing the two, Lin Feng instantly felt much more relaxed. Even in the mech state, the energy consumption per hour was not as much as the energy Lin Feng absorbed from the surroundings. He could still store 2 megajoules per hour. It seemed that Lin Feng's talent was designed according to the warrior concubine from the beginning. It's still early. Let's find Sister Wei for a training session. Then we can go back and take revenge on those hungry wolves. Quote. There was no need to worry about energy consumption. Now, it was time to operate. Yes, I've been waiting for this day for a long time. Saying that, Su Qingyan opened her battle watch. Then, a sci-fi holographic screen was projected in front of them. The call screen lasted for less than two seconds before Jian Wei accepted the video call. Jian Wei's happy face appeared on the screen. Lin Feng said bluntly, Sister Wei, we are all eager to find those flame wolves from this morning to take revenge. Is it convenient for you to give us some training? Lin Feng also did not like the feeling of running away. If he could get back at them today, he would not wait until tomorrow. Of course, send me the time, I'll go apply for the simulation pod now. Quote. Jian Wei did not hesitate. Whether it was Principal Lu's request or her own heart, she was looking forward to it. All right, we'll come over now. About 10 minutes. How is it? Teacher Jian Wei is pretty, right? Do you want me to arrange a time for you to get to know her better? Su Qingyan teased. Lin Feng was not in a hurry. He said faintly, another day. It's a good change. Are they all so direct? Prepare to have an in-depth discussion with him. Quote. Lin Feng was stunned. I'm really just the dimension of time. I've always been curious about how you manage to fuse the two opposite sides of you so perfectly. Every woman has two sides, but the other side can only be owned by the person she loves the most. I've heard that a confident man sometimes doesn't like a woman who is more confident than him. Su Qingyan used a different tone and expression to fully demonstrate what it meant to be a sharp contrast. Then, she looked at Lin Feng seriously and said, let's not talk about this for now. I'm asking you something serious. Let's put aside my factor and other factors and see if teacher Jian Wei is moved at all. She is indeed. Lin Feng did not hide this point. After all, Jian Wei's temperament, figure, appearance, and personality were all very good. Moreover, it was an S-grade phantom motorcycle. After contracting it, it could increase her attributes and obtain a good amount of points. Who would not be moved? I understand. Get on. While speaking, Su Qingyan had already transformed into the dazzling bladed chariot. After completing the contract, the two of them were much more at ease. They were not as shy as before. Lin Feng entered the driver's seat and started the connection process. Identity verification successful. Energy connection successful. Current energy ratio, 32%. Current duration, indefinite commander's energy core's energy absorption speed is faster than Zanji's consumption. Resonance system pairing successful. Interaction system pairing successful. After the contract was successful, there was an interaction system. 
Even if the commander obtained control, the two of them could still communicate. Hubby's talent is really unbearable. You can actually keep fighting. I can't guarantee that I can keep going. It seems like I can't satisfy you alone. Her voice was a little charming, completely different from her previous coldness. Lin Feng smiled. I'm the one driving. Why does it sound like you're the one driving? Hee hee, the system's advice can't be trusted completely. It didn't consider my physical strength and energy at all. However, I realize that your physical fitness is much higher than ordinary people. I don't know if you can handle it. Quote. Wife, you're playing with fire. Be careful that you don't get executed on the spot. Don't, I'm just joking. I'm a little excited because I'm getting married today. If other people saw this side of Su Qingyan, they would probably have a mental breakdown. You'll be even more excited during the wedding night. At that time, you'll know if you can handle it or not. N. Su Qingyan's voice was like a mosquito's buzzing. However, this already let Lin Feng know her attitude. I've always had a question. When I'm driving, will you feel it? After saying that, Lin Feng purposely made a mischievous move and touched the smooth lines. You, of course you will feel it. However, with a mech, your sensitivity will be weakened by a lot. All right, stop fooling around. We're here. Then, Su Qingyan changed into her human form. Happy times really pass quickly. Su Qingyan smiled lightly, and her tone carried a teasing tone. Lin Feng scratched Su Qingyan's nose and smirked. Don't worry. There's no doubt about my endurance. I hope you can still smile tomorrow. The two of them walked into the practical training building. Jian Wei was already waiting outside the simulation pod. Jian Wei at the door was still as good and intelligent as ever, pure and lustful. The tight-fitting uniform skirt coupled with black high heels, accentuated her perfect figure to the fullest. Slender and graceful, free and easy, soft and delicate, with a slender waist that could not be held in one's hand, her long hair falling over her shoulders. Falling, her starry eyes half-hidden, her smile like a blooming flower. Her smile seemed to be able to melt people in an instant, making them forget all their troubles. Her exquisite spectacles were the finishing touch. Big sister Wei, sorry for the trouble. Not at all. The principal had specifically instructed me to satisfy your needs as much as possible. Jian Wei pulled out a card after saying that, this is the authentication card for your luxurious villa. All the facilities and daily necessities are complete and you can move in immediately. It's over at the Star Glory Guild Hall. Lin Feng immediately took the authentication card from her and was a little surprised at her quick efficiency, thank you. You're welcome. Both of you are highly gifted and normal teaching might affect your progress. Hence, the principal asked me to be your personal tutor, to be on standby 24 hours a day. Quote. That's making me feel a little embarrassed. We will try not to take up too much of your time. It's all right. Being able to groom an outstanding commander and warrior would be of great help to the entire fire country. Speaking of which, I really envy the two of you, to be able to find partners who are compatible in all aspects. Quote. Ching Yun sees the opportunity to interject. Teacher, don't be envious. Why don't you be Lin Feng's personal tutor? Teach him knowledge in the day and posture at night. He's still a newbie and needs more nourishment. Quote. Ching Yun, I noticed that the way you speak has changed after the contract. You're even making fun of your teacher now. Aren't I not treating you as an outsider? Tell me what you think. Your husband was just saying on the way here that he wanted to have a deep discussion with you. Quote. Lin Feng coughed lightly, feeling a little speechless. Can you not be so considerate? It's not like I can't handle it. But I like it. Jian Wei's face was a little red. I can do it. I don't have any problems with the knowledge, but I haven't studied the posture. She then lowered her head, not daring to look at Lin Feng. Su Qing Yun glanced at Lin Feng, looking like she had succeeded in her evil scheme. What are you still standing there for? Big Sister Wei has already expressed herself. Doesn't every man have a dream of riding a motorcycle? There aren't many S-grade motorcycles and you'll regret it for the rest of your life. Quote. Su Qingyan winked at Lin Feng and continued. You don't have to feel burdened. In this world, combat power is the most important thing. Other professions, identities, and family factors don't matter. Moreover, the application process is very complicated. Let's do it as soon as possible. 
Lin Feng already had an idea. Now that he had said so, he didn't hesitate at all. Then I'll make a request first. Jian Wei raised her head in surprise. Her starry eyes were a little moist, like the river water reflected by the Milky Way. Excitement. How touching. Or perhaps it was because the commander they had been waiting for for so many years had finally appeared and could become a true battle concubine. Thank you, Lin Feng. Please take care of me for the rest of my life. Then, he stretched out his hand gracefully. Lin Feng was a little surprised. He couldn't get used to it. A highly talented commander had a very high status. Please take care of me. We'll be a family in the future. We'll learn from each other's strengths to make up for our weaknesses. Let's start the class then. Jian Wei quickly blinked her eyes and adjusted her state of mind. Sorry, I lost my composure a little. Follow me into the simulation pod first. The two of them followed her into the simulation pod corresponding to the blade dancer. The various equipment inside was basically the same as the blade dancers. Then, she explained all the controls and function buttons one by one. Concise and easy to understand, she was indeed very talented as a teacher. Next, let's look at the specific parameters of the mech. After Su Qingyan authorized, the detailed data of the blade dancer appeared on the screen. S grade blade dancer, kinetic core, blade 231 thousandths. Level, 1 star mech. Firepower. 3000 close combat. 3000. Ranged. 0. Base state shield value. 1000. Mech. Material. Ceramic synthetic metal body. Value. 2000. Weapon. Waning moon. A grade. Special skill. Sky raising slash. A grade. Open black lens bracket. Close black lens bracket. Jian Wei pointed at the data on the screen and began to explain. The kinetic core can be increased by using the energy crystals of demonic beasts killed. A servant crystal can increase it by 10 points. The ranks of demonic beasts from low to high were, servant, warrior, general, commander, overlord, commander, monarch, demon king, and demon god. They corresponded to 1 to 9 stars of the mech respectively. Close combat firepower can be increased by equipment or martial arts. Ranged firepower can be increased by installing ranged weapons. After the base state shield is broken, the damage will directly affect the mech. Quote dot 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 quote. After explaining all the data, Jian Wei activated the equipment and let the two of them stand at the corresponding position. Okay, now we'll connect to the system and begin the simulation. The nervous system is mainly used to ensure that the commander can obtain absolute control and control with his consciousness. The commander can control the mech through the interactive system but he can't control the mech and can't disobey any of the commander's orders. The sensory system allows the commander to control the mech's movements through movements and at the same time, feel the mech's pain. Quote dot 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 quote. After a series of explanations, Jian Wei demonstrated once while Lin Feng also operated it once. The basic operation was already clear. That's the main content. You can go to the training ground to experience the real mech. Jian Wei spoke eloquently for a while and her voice was already a little hoarse. Lin Feng also handed her a glass of water at the right time. Thank, thank you. Jian Wei was surprised and a little surprised. This small action left a good impression on Jian Wei and they would be more compatible in the future. You're welcome. Oh right, Wei Wei, do you know how to modify mechs? Can you teach me too? Quote. Lin Feng saw that the system had given him an S-grade accessory but he didn't know how to modify it. If he could equip it, his combat power should increase by a lot. I don't know how to do that. The technical difficulty of modification and maintenance is very high. Modifications are done by official organizations or specialized modification shops. Lin Feng also understood that this was not a machine but a war concubine with a soul and consciousness. It wouldn't be that easy to modify. However, how could he let others touch his own mech? He had to modify it himself. Therefore, he set his eyes on the shop. Since it was given, it should also tell him how to modify it. As expected, in the shop, there was a 3000 points manual for the maintenance of machine ladies. Although it was a little expensive, the important thing was that one could understand it directly and didn't need to learn it bit by bit. Moreover, according to the introduction, the modification and maintenance level was far beyond the current technology that humans had mastered. 
Debut is the pinnacle. He currently had 2,000 points. If he wanted to buy the maintenance book, he would need another 1,000 points. Lin Feng decided to put this as his first priority. After all, the bladed mech lacked long-range firepower. He had to make up for it as soon as possible. Melee combat was much more dangerous. He had to love his battlesuit. Then, should we go straight to the buffer zone? Lin Feng was now in high spirits. Yes, let's kill those wolves. Su Qingyan was instantly energized. Now, they didn't have to poach in the buffer zone anymore. Before, they could only find an opportunity to kill a lone servant class mech. Every time, they would have to leave due to lack of energy. Vroom, the bladed mech roared again. After the discussion just now, the two of them had a better understanding of each other. The bladed mech was like a flash of blue lightning as it shuttled through the streets of the city. Lin Feng stopped at the sentry post. Entering the buffer zone required verification at the border sentry post. The police station was in charge of the city area. The buffer zone was usually in charge of the city's security forces. Between the forbidden zone and the buffer zone were usually stationed people from the military. Two female security guards in aquamarine police uniforms were checking the information. The only difference between the uniforms of the security forces and the police was the color and badge. The leader was quite good looking. She naturally exuded a heroic aura. Judging from the warm smile on her face, she should be familiar with Su Qingyan. Blade Dancer, how long are you going to stay this time? It depends on my husband's mood this time, Su Qingyan said cheerfully. Your husband? No way, you found a commander. Quote. Yes, I just contracted him today. He's very beautiful. If you're interested in him, he shouldn't be an ordinary commander, right? The woman said as she looked into the car. Just five words, I can keep doing this. I still have energy left. You can experience the rest yourself. The two security ladies also lowered their heads curiously and looked into the car. Seeing this, Lin Feng rolled down the window and stuck his head out with a smile. Hello, I'll have to trouble you in the future. Okay, be careful. If you encounter danger and can't escape, please contact us immediately. Also, we found traces of aberrated mechs two days ago. Be careful, quote. The leader of the security team quietly handed Lin Feng a private communication card. Clearly, he understood Su Qingyan's meaning. Okay, thank you. Lin Feng took it. Then, he drove away and glanced at the business card. Millie, captain of the Blue Flame Squad. At this moment, Su Qingyan said, M.I. Li is a pretty good person, and she's strong as well. She was the one who brought reinforcements when I was trapped twice. But this is the first time she's given a personal ID card to someone. Quote. I noticed that you seem to be very keen on finding me a battle concubine. Are you afraid that you won't be able to handle it? Lin Feng was a little surprised. Not all of them. The Twin Cities battle is in a week's time. The rewards are very generous. There are many high-grade components and energy crystals. The individual competition is based on individual mecha points. Wouldn't it be better for you to take all the top three prizes by yourself? The team competition is a cooperative mecha competition. Wouldn't it be better for one person to take the entire team's prize? More importantly, the top three of the Battle of the Twin Cities will be able to participate in the national championship. If they can get a good ranking, it won't just be a simple reward. If you obtain the title of Unparalleled Scholar, wouldn't it be better for the country to help you level up? Quote. Su Qingyan continued to attack, and even Lin Feng was tempted. There was nothing wrong with that. Then, he went straight to the place where he was attacked. Demonic Beast Aura detected. Please prepare for battle. Lin Feng looked at the screen. Sure enough, there were a few red dots approaching. Qingyan, transform. Lin Feng left the tank. Kacha, 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 and then a 5 meter tall bladed armor appeared in front of Lin Feng. It looked very heroic. The hatch slowly opened. Honey, come up. Lin Feng jumped into the cockpit and connected to the system. Although the operation was similar to the simulation pod, the feeling was completely different. This extreme sense of control was not something the simulation pod could simulate. Lin Feng brought out Waning Moon. The ear-piercing sound of metal made the ground tremble. With a light wave, he could vaguely hear the sound of air tearing. With this size and strength, 
I shouldn't need to use any special skills to kill a servant class monster. Lin Feng came to this conclusion after feeling it for a while. After all, special skills would consume extra energy. Then, he tried all the normal movements again and understood the characteristics of the bladed armor. The biggest characteristic of the bladed armor was its high agility and strong micro-control. Agility was a characteristic of the kinetic energy system. The reason why it could operate meticulously and accurately in real time was that the bladed armor was made up of more than 3,000 independent mechs. Each independent mech had its own kinetic energy system and sensor system. After understanding it, Lin Feng did not wait and rushed forward. Waning Moon left a long scratch on the ground. It was a shocking sight. A Wu. A few flame wolves also sensed the danger and roared crazily. Lin Feng met the flame wolf head on. He raised his blade and slashed upwards. A flame wolf was instantly split into two halves. Moreover, it was thrown high up into the air. Fresh blood drew a beautiful arc in the air. Killed a servant class flame wolf. Double reward, servant class energy crystals x2, points increased by 2 asterisk 10. It was convenient to have the system. He did not have to do anything to harvest the energy crystals. It was double the reward, but the points were not enough. It seemed that 1000 points would take some time. At this time, the flame wolves behind him looked cautiously. They showed fear in their eyes and were ready to turn and run. Lin Feng locked onto the next flame wolf and ended its life with one slash. Killed a servant class monster. Open black lens bracket, close black lens bracket. None of the nine servant class flame wolves managed to escape. Killing a servant class monster with one slash. It felt so good. Su Qingyu was also surprised. I've finally vented my anger after a year. In the past, I had to run after killing one. Now, I have to run even after killing one. However, I have to chase after the flame wolves that are scared out of their wits. Warning, a servant class hell flame wolf has appeared. Warning, a servant class hell flame wolf has appeared. The system's warning kept flashing. According to the default settings, the one star armor's target was a servant class magical beast. I want to try, Su Qingyan said slowly. Lin Feng looked at the status and then at the soldier class information. The soldier class magical beast was considered a small boss. It had special skills, but there was a chance of obtaining accessories after killing it. Okay, destroy it. Lin Feng controlled the mecha and entered the battle zone. Opponent's level is higher than yours. All attributes increased by 50%. Su Qingyan felt something strange in her body. What's going on? I feel like my combat power and defense have increased tremendously. Quote. Of course, Lin Feng also felt the increase in his attributes. It was as if he had eaten a calming pill. Lin Feng smiled and said, this is just a small surprise. Follow me and prepare to take off. We can fight in the clouds during the day and at night. Lin Feng didn't retreat. Instead, he went forward and faced it head on. The 5 meter tall hellfire wolf was stunned when it saw the mecha coming toward it. It was the first time it saw a mecha that dared to charge at it directly. The steel armor on his back immediately dispersed, and a huge cannon appeared. Violent flames spewed out, as if even the air was burning. All the leaves within a hundred meters dried up and turned into ashes. A wave of heat surged toward the blade dancer. Basic shield. The moment the shield was activated, the waning moon in her hand shone brightly. The bladed mech leapt into the air and activated its steering booster. Sky raising slash. With lightning speed, she slashed at the hellfire wolf's neck from an extremely precise angle. Clang, clang, it didn't even make a sound. Its head was separated from its body and it fell to the ground, kicking up a cloud of dust. Killed hellfire wolf. Obtained. Hellfire cannon x2, soldier class crystal x2. Points increased by 100. A soldier class crystal had 5 times the energy of a servant class crystal. One crystal could provide 50 points of growth. It was usually sold at 50,000 yen dollars per crystal. Its points were also five times that of a servant class crystal. What excited Lin Feng the most was the Hellfire Cannon. He got what he wanted. Hellfire Bubble D class, able to continuously spit out high intensity oxidizing flames at 3,500 degrees Celsius. Energy consumption per second. After installation, Mecha's energy consumption will increase by 1 megajoule per hour. 
D-grade was already the best equipment dropped by a soldier-level warrior. Even if it was a D-grade, its value had already reached 20 million. The rich play with mechas, the poor play with cars. Mechs were indeed extravagant items. Even an F-grade accessory would cost a few million. At this moment, Su Qingyan, who had regained her senses, asked in shock, you killed a soldier-level magical beast with one strike. Don't you feel embarrassed? Although he said so, he was amazed in his heart. Although the process of killing the Hellfire Wolf seemed to be very short, the skill and microcontrol required was very high. He had only trained for two hours, but he was able to perform as well as a three-star commander. Lin Feng said indifferently, too weak, too weak, and there are too few of them. Now that he had combat experience, he suddenly felt that killing soldier-level martial warriors was still the best. It was just that they weren't easy to find. Furthermore, he had made a special observation just now. A single heaven's raising slash only consumed 5 mega joules of energy, which was still acceptable. The benefits were extremely good. Most importantly, there was still a chance of dropping accessories. Lin Feng continued to search for traces of magical beasts. Junhai City, Buffer Zone, Sentry Post F. Suddenly, Millie received an urgent call. Hearing the voice, Millie was stunned. It was actually a call from the Director General himself. Director General Chin, what's the matter? Chin Yu said anxiously, according to the military's report, two aberrated mechanical suits escaped from the mechanical abyss forbidden grounds. They're heading to Area F now. Bring all your team members and set off immediately. Save Lin Feng at all costs. I've already asked my assistant to inform all the surrounding teams to head to Area F to pick you up. Chin Yu conveyed all the information in one breath. His speed was extremely fast. Roger, set off immediately. After hanging up the phone, he immediately turned to the vice captain beside him and said, gather all the teams and set off immediately. Those who are still alive, follow me. Millie knew that the person whom the director general called personally was definitely not a simple person. Thus, she did not dare to relax at all. She seemed to have some impression of the name Lin Feng. She quickly searched for Lin Feng's information in the registration information. Blade Dancer, so it's him. Millie was a little shocked. Where did this person come from? Not to mention that he had contracted an S-grade battleship. The director general personally called and said that they had to do it at all costs. She was getting more and more curious about Lin Feng. Qin Yu was the director general of the Junhai City Defense Forces Operations Division. He was originally reviewing Lin Feng's application to contract multiple battleships. However, when he saw that it was an SSS talent, he was instantly shocked. It was actually an SSS talent, and it was located in Junhai City. He was even more overjoyed. He opened the system excitedly to check Lin Feng's information and saw that Lin Feng had registered to enter the buffer zone to hunt demonic beasts. After all, he had just contracted demonic beasts and was already in the buffer zone to hunt demonic beasts. However, at this moment, he received an emergency call from the military. A bolt of lightning struck down like a thunderbolt from the clear sky. The aberrated mechanical suit had escaped. Furthermore, the military was trying their best to stop the escaping aberrated mechanical suits and demonic beasts. There was no way for them to provide support. What made Qin Yu even more devastated was that Lin Feng was in that area. If something really happened, it would be a huge loss. Furthermore, he was in his own territory. That would be even more unbearable. On the other side, the members of a demon hunting team were escaping crazily. They did not dare to relax at all. They were almost stepping on the gas pedal. Lin Feng had just killed tens of thousands of servant-class demonic beasts. From afar, he saw the billowing dust, thick smoke, and chaotic roars. As that group of people kept getting closer, the system also gave a warning the moment they entered the range. Warning. Aberrated mechanical suit has appeared 2,000 meters away. Please evacuate quickly. Warning. Aberrated mechanical suit has appeared 2,000 meters away. Please evacuate quickly. Like and subscribe my channel.